I'm Brian Westbrook with Geekwire Studios. Pleased to be joined here at NVIDIA GTC by the Chief Business Officer of Nebius, Ronan Chernin. First of all, what have you seen so far? What are you excited about here at GTC? Yeah, thank you for having me. Uh, actually, I'm amazed on the scale. So I think the best way to understand how AI is developing is just see what is the city today. And we're here in the lobby. We are literally in the epicenter of it all. But also at the forefront of conversations this week is the partnership between NVIDIA and Nebius. Tell us about that. What are you most excited about? Yeah, I think uh, this is very important partnership for us, obviously. And just to remind, NVIDIA is not only our supplier, but also investor. So there is a lot of tiers between us. And I think the most important thing that we're focusing on is how we deliver the product together. Because the product we build is pretty complicated, and there are certain levels, uh, starting from the data centers that we need to build, uh, keeping in mind what is the next generation of the chips coming, then the hardware that we build as a partner of NVIDIA, we are OEM, so we are uh, not buying boxes from others. So we closely work with our engineering team to just make things work. And then the next level is software, which if you heard the, uh, uh, the keynote of Jensen, he probably mentioned many times how much NVIDIA wants to be not only hardware, but software company. And we are one of their participants of their ecosystem that probably moves this direction because we never wanted to be just the infrastructure. We wanted to be the software, the product company. How does all of this play into key differentiators for the end user experience on the Nebius platform? Yeah, so I think the main thing that users already feel is how fast we can serve them and that we can serve with a equal quality, I hope, <laughs> uh, the customers of different sizes, starting from those who come to our self-service with credit card, rent one GPU for a few hours and run some experiments or some pet project and up to multi-thousand interconnected clusters that build for purpose. It's all run one by one platform, software platform, and we can provision the resources, we can uh, serve it like swiftly, like provisioning resources in hours and days, not weeks or months. Uh, and yeah, it's time to value. And obviously reliability and performance is the like bread and butter of us. And one of the key things that even the smallest customers appreciate is that ability to scale, the ability to be on one platform through the entire journey. Let's talk about AI, obviously a big topic here, not only at this conference, but really just all over. How is, how is Nebius helping and the partnership helping in the AI landscape? How are we helping evolve the AI journey for Nebius customers? Yeah, we, like I like to say that we are building unsexiest part of the most sexiest industry. So actually, uh, our customers are doing all this great job to research and develop the new products. And everyone needs the fuel for that. And actually, what we provide is the fuel. Uh, but it's not just the electricity anymore. So uh, you want to optimize the pace of experiments. You want to optimize the flexibility. You want to provide the best experience, like developer experience, and that's why we're so, so much focused on the software layer. Lots of great things happening. One of them is a big expansion. You're recently moving with really great efforts into the United States and expanding your markets. As Chief Business Officer, walk me through what that looks like, not only for the company and the team, but for the market in general. Yeah, I think it's not a secret that a lot of demand here in the US. So uh, we, historically started our first capacity war in Europe, but we, from the first day, understood that our uh, key market is US. And to be here, you need to build two parts. You need to be presented as an infrastructure, and you need to build a team. So that's what we focus on. And the last announcement that we made with the large uh, locations uh, let us just scale and serve larger and larger customers, which is important in this market. As we would expect with any big conferences, lots of great news, lots of great announcements, one of them involving Blackwell Ultra. What are we talking about here as far as being an early adopter? Yeah, so for us, it's important to bring to the market the new generation of the chips as early as possible because our customers are very demanding. So they wanted 
touch the stuff, the newest stuff as, as early as possible. And we were announced as uh, one of the first partners of NVIDIA who adopt the uh, Blackwell Ultra, the next generation of the chips. So it's, uh, it's the next step of performance and uh, the, new, the new tasks will be unlocked, hopefully. It's exciting stuff. Uh, it's always good to see the customers not only demanding, but driving the adoption of those chips. It's great that you're right there with it. What else should we expect? Uh, what are uh, coming announcements? Yeah, so another thing that I, I want to highlight is we work closely with the internal engineering teams of NVIDIA and uh, we will be one of the earliest adopter of their benchmarking framework. So actually, NVIDIA wants to make sure their partners like us are providing the best experience to the customers and they release some kind of receipts of performance testing and improvements. And we'll be, we were one of the first who already used it and we justify that we are providing the best performance in our clusters. Uh, and it will be something that will kind of standardize the quality on this market that is still not very equal from provider to provider. It's exciting developments. Thank you so much for joining us. Ronan Shernan, Chief Business Officer for Nebius. Enjoy the rest of the show. I know you've got a lot to get to. I'm Brian Westbrook with GeekWire Studios. Thanks for watching.